Hi friends, Leslie from Discovery Fabrics and today we're going to talk about another one of our favorite patterns by Canadian pattern maker Jolie. This is the Pika bra and uh, layered top. So it's actually either a bra on its own like a power bra or you can have this additional uh, modest layered top uh, almost like an overlay that's attached to it. We really love Jolie patterns. Uh, in particular, we like that they come in 27 sizes, so you can use the same master pattern to make uh, one for your uh, teen or one for yourself. So I'm going to show you one that we made. This is uh, one of my daughter's favorite tops. She had one from Lululemon that looked very similar to this, and she loved it. So we decided to make um, this in very similar fabrics. Now, we have chosen mid-weight scuba for the bra portion of this and we've lined it with our amazing soft power mesh and we used a very very lightweight polar tech power dry for the flowy overlay now as i mentioned you can make this as a bra on its own or you can make it with a layered overlay just for a little bit of modesty or just for style but it's super cute um, I'm going to show you a couple of fabrics that we think would be really good for the bra portion of it. And then we've chosen a selection of fabrics that you could choose to make if you wanted to have something drapey or airy. If you were using this for working out, for example, and wanted a little bit more of airflow. So here we have Midweight Scuba, which is very compressive. This is beautiful scuba that comes from the Borgini Mill in Italy. And this is tri -geo Coral. And one of the uh, things that you could perhaps line this with is our power mesh uh, in black or um, any color really, it doesn't really show, but we like the black with it. And we also wanted to show Breathe Mesh. Now this is in the alloy color. Breathe Mesh is less compressive uh, than power mesh. It's mostly used for costuming and just for drapey inserts. Uh, it's, uh, as I said, it's very light and airy and would be really nice for an overlay on that particular fabric. Um, this is actually, the next one is Polar Tech Power Stretch Jersey, but this is a style that I've never really showed before. And I really love this because it's almost got like a little bird's eye um, hole in it. So a little bit of airflow going through there. So I really like this for athletic tops. This is um, style 94065 Polar Tech Power Mesh or, or I'm sorry, power stretch jersey. And we do have power stretch in fleece backs too, so you wouldn't be looking in that section. You would be definitely looking under the power stretch jersey for this style. So that would be a light flowy overlay um, for any of the following fabrics that would look really good. The fabric that we have next that would be really good for the bra portion, and we use this for leggings a lot, is called Yoga Stretch. This is Margarita Pink. Uh, this actually comes from the same mill that Lululemon uses uh, and is the same content for uh, Luon. Uh, that is their brand name. And the next that I wanted to show you is Solar Stretch. Solar Stretch is a great uh, weight. It's not terribly compressive, but it's still really great for leggings and power bras and tops. And it's also a very, very highly sun protective. So people really love it for that. It's got a very soft hand, nice stretch. This is our poppies um, pattern. We're just about out of that. And I thought it would be paired really nicely with a lightweight Quick Wick. Now Quick Wick is very, very similar to Polar Tech Power Dry. We have it in both lightweight and midweight. This happens to be a lightweight in violet color. And we just thought that would be really cute. You don't need to have a ton of stretch for the overlay because it's got a lot of gathers across the front. So, so that's going to compensate if it isn't terribly stretchy. But still, this does have nice stretch. Um, this is actually really good for cycling shirts and things. Um, and it is also highly sun protective. Next, I've been showing a lot lately is our uh, fabric called Breathe Tech. This is a beautiful poppies print, a black and white monochromatic poppies, not a poppies, a pansy print, sorry. And uh, very, very soft. This fabric feels like butter. It's um, got great stretch and recovery. That would make an amazing power bra. So that would be good for the Pika. And then you could use this as an overlay, as an option to the breathe mesh. This is power mesh. So you actually could use the power mesh both inside the bra for more support and also as an overlay um, for that airy 
modest kind of fashionable look. And last but not least, I wanted to show you a fabric that we've got called Open Cell Mesh. And this basically would just be a really good choice. It doesn't have any stretch, but it's really nice for an airy overlay. Um, it actually makes really cute uh, tops or actual beach cover-ups, that kind of thing. So we have many, many more fabrics that would work for the Pika. Uh, we simply can't bring them all out. But really what you're looking for is a fabric that has got some compression to it for the bra, really great recovery, and then something light and flowy. You could even use any of the natural fabrics that we've got, any of the bamboo stretches or Modell jersey or any of those. Tensil would also be good for the overlay. You just have to have that compression athletic for the bra part. That's it for now. If you have any questions, please ask them in our Facebook group. So inspired by Discovery Fabrics and thanks for watching.